So the other day I made a post on how a woman's body count should absolutely not matter to you as a man in dating. In the comment section, I saw that a lot of you guys basically said that if a woman has a high body count, she'll be more likely to cheat on you if she's with you and she will have trouble pair bonding. I see a lot of guys use these like general stats and figures, um, but I'm gonna tell you guys the truth, which is that even if a woman has a high body count or has been super sexual in the past, if you are truly the right guy for her and she is head over heels in love with you, she is going to be 125% loyal to you and will not cheat, period. The key here though, is that you have to be a high quality enough guy for her to want to stay around. Now, most of y'all, I'm just gonna be honest, are simply not that high quality guy who are commenting on here. You either don't have financial security, this is what I mean by high quality, you don't have a lot of sexual experience because you're staying at home watching more P-O-R-N than you are actually getting out there and getting real life practice in bed with women. You have little to no social skills or you just have shit confidence and don't feel highly about yourself. I want you to know that I'm not offending you. I'm trying to help and that, that if you work on all of these areas in your life, she is going to want to stick around and start a family with you. Even the women with high body counts. So if you're triggered by my high body count post, just know that that means that you have stuff to work on. You deserve to have sex with women that you are excited about. And the only way that you're going to do that is if you leave your house, get out there and practice, guys. Get off of Pornhub and get out there in the real world. Follow for more dating tips. i tell you one thing, guys. Do not listen to relationship advice from women. That is the worst thing you could do. There's so many holes in what she just said. And if you follow this, you're just headed down the road to doom. That's really what it is. A woman's body count matters to men. Women don't care. They don't care about men's feelings. They don't care about what men want. Now, this is a supposed to be a dating coach, right? She's get, supposed to be giving men dating advice, but yet she's not listening to what men say, what men want. The reason that men care about body count comes down to paternity. Since the beginning of time, men have always had to know and, and be assured that that baby that that woman was carrying was his. He cannot do that. If the woman that he is sleeping with is promiscuous or has been promiscuous. Men do not like women with high body counts. Just like women don't like men that don't have resources that can't protect them, that can't take care of them, that can't provide for the offspring. It's the same thing. A woman will not go out there and date a bum, get in a relationship with the bum. That's why you hear women say, oh, he got to have this money. He got to have this. He got to have that. So all of that is true for a woman, right? It's true for a man that we don't like women with high body counts. You know that list that women have six feet or over six feet, six pack, six figure income all these qualifications that men have to meet. You know, the women that usually have that list, you know, you know who they are. Those are the women that have been promiscuous. Those are the women that have slept with multiple men and had nothing in return, nothing lasting. What they've done is they've taken a bit of each one of those experiences with those men and combined it into a list. And they believe that that list, there's a person that matches that list, but there is not. So there's telling signs about women when they say things like this. This woman is not just trying to give you general advice. She's speaking a lot from her personal experience, which is wrong. And that's why I say, guys, you should not listen to a woman for advice relationship advice that is 
You should not do that. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video review. If you could do me a favor, like and subscribe to my channel. There should be a button down at the bottom right of this video. If you're on TikTok, please go ahead and just click the heart button and give me a follow. I'd appreciate it. Thanks a lot again and have a great one.